Hello everybody and welcome to Friday's update. So how did you all go with identifying that one emotion last week that you were really living in for the week? Did you get some reflections as to how it was adding value to you or was it draining you? Was it in relation to a worry or a concern or was it in relation to successful outcomes? It's really great when we do identify where we as a human being, as a person, as a leader are living with our emotions. So many times our emotions just go by without us really thinking of what we're feeling and without realizing one emotion can use three lots of energy, which means it's draining us three times faster. We're aging three times faster. For example, if you're consistently living in a negative emotion, it's going to be in your mind. It's going to be in your heart, but physically you're doing something else. So your heart is saying something, your mind is thinking something and physically on your physiology level, you're doing something else. So literally using three lots of energy that's not serving you. This week's question, I'm going to ask the same one again. What emotion really took over your life this week and how did it serve you as a human being and as a leader? I look forward to speaking to you all next week. My name is Pushpa. I'm your friend and please do get in touch if you've got any questions.